We begin with an update to a story we first broke to you on ValleyCentral.com. You were listening to Sherryland Pioneer High School Band performing at the UIL Area G Marching Contest this past Saturday in Mercedes. Yeah, but both Pioneer and Sherryland both made it to state. But this evening, a UIL committee voted to reprimand both schools for allegedly violating UIL rules. According to the Executive Secretary for District 15, Ruben Adame, the meeting was requested by Mary Solis, principal of Porter Early High School, in Brownsville, Solis claimed that both Sherryland and Sherryland Pioneer marching band pulled students out of class and bused them to Tiger Stadium in Mercedes to practice on October 22nd, the week leading up to Saturday's Area G marching band competition, which was also held in Mercedes. Solis quoted UIL and TEA policies that prohibit students missing more than one hour of instructional periods for band practice. And so Luis also provided these pictures as evidence in that meeting showing Sherryland ISD vehicles at Mercedes on the day in question. Elaine Howard, Sherryland superintendent, represented the district stating that she had learned of the allegations just yesterday at around 4 p.m. but said that the executive committee learned of the accusations last Tuesday before the competition was held. And she says they weren't even notified until yesterday that the committee would be scheduling a meeting. Howard acknowledged Sherry Lanbad did hold a practice in Mercedes, but maintains they didn't go over the allotted one hour of time for practice. And yeah, she further claimed that UIL states that these actions are discouraged but not prohibited. Howard said that she took full responsibility for any violations, but didn't feel that the students should be punished for it. But after more than 30 minutes in executive session, the Region 15 UIL Executive Committee decided to issue a reprimand to both Sherryland schools. The committee did not specify what this means. Soli said she'll be seeking further action from the state. We are very, very passionate about uh, for all students. Um, but um, I just wanted to get a little bit of uh, guidance because I will be requesting an emergency meeting at the state level. And I wanted to know who I could address this uh, this request to. Now, Sherryland ISD did give us a statement. Now they're telling us that while the committee issued Sherryland ISD a reprimand, it affirmed that our band's eligibility to advance and perform at the state competition remains valid. And we'll continue to keep you up to date with this story, and we want to hear from you. Do you think that the UIL Executive Committee for Region 15 ruled fairly? You can have your voice heard right now. Just go to valleycentral.com slash vote.